Your zone of control is the space around you that it's not safe for your opponent to advance into. Your weapon's range is a huge impact on this. The Jet Squelcher's circle is a lot bigger than the Splatter Shot's. So the Splatter Shot can't approach it safely, right? Well, not always. Splatoon maps provide cover. The Splatter Shot can keep a wall between it and the longer range weapon to give it time to get within range. When one team loses control of the zone around the objective, the other team is able to score. In Clam Blitz, you can score when your opponents are not controlling the zone around their basket. In Rainmaker, you can score when you're holding the Rainmaker and your opponents don't control the zone in front of it, wherever in front of it happens to be. In Tower Control, you can score when your opponents don't control the zone the tower has to pass through. In Splat Zones, Splat Zones, well I trust you can figure that one out.